Hello everybody, this is Danny Watney with Primo RV at Sunset Louisiana Service Center, right? So today I just wanted to kind of uh, reintroduce something that a lot of people tend to forget about. Uh, it's the anode rod that goes into your heater, okay, your water heater. Anode rods are located right here at the bottom, typically a hex. Um, if you see a plastic cap, that means you do not have an anode rod. You may be able to add one. You just got to call your service center and find out. Anode rods are built with a material that is a soft metal material, softer than your tanks are. The purpose of this is, is the minerals in the water wants to eat the metals. So if you put something softer than what the tank is, it eats that first. Now, if your anode rod is going completely and you haven't changed it on it, the next thing it eats is your tank. You run into major issues. We start having water leakage and you got to get your tanks from underbelly removed. And, turns into a, a, quite a bit of a cost uh, to fix. So you always want to keep an eye on your anode rods, especially if you know where you live, you have hard water, soft water. If you're not using water filters, anything like that, that's, uh, you, you should check them pretty regularly, okay? So I, I've saved some examples of people's anode rods that we pulled out and listened to them tell me when or how long ago it was before that they had just changed it. So, as you can see, this person, we checked the inner rod at three months, and this is what his water had done. At 10 months, that's how much was left. At 18 months, there was nothing left, and it was, it was starting to eat his tank. So it's one of those things that you really gotta pay attention to, especially, like I said, if you know your water situations at your home or at the campgrounds where you park at. So just keep an eye on it. They're relatively cheap. They're easy to install and uninstall. It's really a no-brainer, just take care of that. You should have no problems with your tanks at all, okay? Uh, so that's just one little tip, and I just wanted to leave y'all with that. If you have any questions, concerns, or comments, always hit me up. I'm here for you. And as always, for all your RV needs, where do you go? Go to Premium.